If I could go back in time, I would have taken more risks as opportunities were provided to me. I attribute some of it to not understanding what could have been. For example, I was not interested in traveling abroad during college or even at my first law firm, despite the availability of those opportunities. Immediately after law school, I clerked for a federal district court judge, Clifford Scott Green, Jr. He was a, one of the first black judges on the federal bench and was appointed by President Nixon. I often think about how pivotal this experience was for me. It was the best working year of my life. When I think about my parents, both my mom and dad, were influential, though in different ways. My dad insisted that I attend the University of Pennsylvania and Ivy League school, since he knew the importance the pedigree would make for me in pursuing the early goals I had of becoming an engineer and then a lawyer. My mom was a nurse and on the weekends worked a second job in a nursing home. So as a young child, I accompanied her and spent time visiting the residents and spending time with them. This later grew into more formalized volunteer roles she signed me up for at the hospital where she worked full time. When I think about my legacy, my daughters come to mind first. I hope by example, I have shown them how to be resilient, motivated, and brave enough to define success for themselves without being limited by what the world believes. One word that best describes me is dedicated. I have been dedicated to the pursuit of excellence in my faith, family, and career for much of my life.